Hey guys, what up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm getting tatted. Let's go. I'm bringing you with me. We are working on my sleeve. Really excited. I sent her a bunch of inspiration pictures, but I haven't actually seen the design that she has drawn up for today. So let's fucking go. Come on guys, let's go. No, it's fine. Okay. Like I said, this is reality here, baby. We keep it real. <laughs> Holy fuck, you guys. I am so ready to go home, but I love Michaela. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're not in this video. There we go. Yay. <laughs> I'm like very, I'm not really tall. I'm actually this short. Yeah. That's, you are actually shorter. I never really I noticed am, that. I'm five, four. Oh my god. What are you, like five? Five, seven. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I, <laughs> I am so tired. I just got home. As you guys see, we're still wrapped up. All that good stuff. But it looks freaking beautiful. We, <laughs> Michaela wants me to tell you, which I know she's watching this right now. We had to stop. Like, this is not the final result. But I was so over it with the shading. Legit starving. Like, so hungry. So, Uncle Nanny's hungry boy too. He's a hungry boy. Mm. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, we did add ghost name right here. But I will show you 
the final everything soon. By the way, all of my makeup came off from my mask. And I think I was like going like this so much that my cheeks like rubbed off too, which is kind of funny, but yeah. Whew, you guys, I'm exhausted and I need food and sleep, so. Hey you guys, what up? So today is Thursday. I had my tattoo appointment on Tuesday. So it's kind of been about two days. It's actually very late at night. It is 9.45 p.m., <laughs> which is crazy. I've had this makeup on for probably the last five hours and I also got a chemical peel yesterday done on my face which is really why I didn't like film that much because I was filming another vlog which I'm sure you guys will see soon um yeah I got extractions done and then a chemical peel which has been quite the experience so I don't know if you can see but my my makeup is literally like cracking off because the skin is starting to peel off which is so crazy so wild my tattoo that's what you care about that's why we're here so oh my gosh you guys like i am so obsessed do you love or do you love let me get a good shot for you so here is kind of a close-up situation so pretty so you guys this is mother nature slash mother earth i think mother nature is what i'm gonna go with though um and you can see she is touching the center of her chest and activating everything around her making it all come alive and she's pregnant with the earth which is so cool we have these gorgeous like leaves greenery flowers um honestly the details are so insane Michaela is so freaking talented and she came up with this design totally for me custom i'm so lucky i know michaela's if you're watching this which i'm sure she is she wants me to tell you guys that we are not done so um we basically did the outline and then the shading and oh my god you guys i will tell you about the craziness so here in the united states you can't really use it's not really legal to use um numbing agents it's not to say that people don't do it but <clears throat> that is just how it is here so it is legal there to use um, a certain percentage in like a spray or a topical so what we usually do which like that only works if the skin is already broken so what we've done in the past like for my past pieces with shading and stuff is um after we do the line work the outline Michaela will then spray it and it kind of numbs up the shading process a little bit it just makes it a little more comfortable takes the edge off um <clears throat> so unfortunately due to covid i'm guessing i don't really know but she hasn't been able to find the product that she normally buys so it has just been a whole thing and basically we didn't use anything on it so we just started shading and oh my god you guys as you saw shading uses more needles it's like wider and it basically you know you're you're going over the already broken skin you're kind of like scraping it and dragging it so whew, you guys it was rough i'm not gonna lie like the outline i did totally fine like didn't face me really whatsoever um until ugh, like i would say maybe this back part of my arm it's like really sensitive then with the shading you guys it was it was a lot so and i think total so i was there from 12 to 6 30 and we um you know messed around with the outline for a little bit and took a little break so the total needle time was roughly around five hours so if you've had tattoos done you know you are probably familiar with the fact that it's kind of takes a toll on your body it's very taxing and afterwards honestly like i was so exhausted <laughs> as you guys could tell probably i think from what i filmed um i was just ready to eat and go to sleep like i was really really tired and i was even really pretty tired yesterday too i honestly like there's way more shading and way more stuff we're adding to this but because I was just kind of like maxed out, I was tapped out, I was like over it, we got to a point where it looks symmetrical, it looks balanced at least, it doesn't look like just an outline, um, and it looks, you know, kind of like a complete piece, even though it's not yet, so. <laughs> Michaela had said, oh, you can't show YouTube, I'm like, no girl, like, we keep it real on this channel, I'm gonna tell them I was a little bitch, okay, like, I was over it. I don't even know how I'm gonna do, like, the inside of my arm, because... 
like when we got to back here you guys oh I was it was not good and I was like bleeding a lot and I think my body my skin was really just ready to be done so what does this mean to me I'm sure you guys will ask honestly it just looks so fucking dope um, I love nature, mother nature. I really believe that I'm very spiritual and I mean this is kind of like personal stuff but I believe that there is a female energy, spirit, creator, god, like whatever you want to call it but there's just some sort of like feminine energy that literally like you know is part of the universe and what better to tap into that than mother nature so yeah i don't know i just it really spoke to me and i sent her some inspo pics and i just am obsessed with the fact that she is pregnant with the earth like that is probably my favorite part honestly so it was such a fun day i love michaela i know you guys didn't get to see too much of her in the vlog other than like her just work doing the work um you know it's a big piece and a lot of work to get done and um yeah, overall, everything came together beautifully. I'm so totally obsessed with it. It's so crazy. I say this every time, but each time I get a tattoo, I just feel more and more like myself, honestly. It's wild. I don't know. If you have tattoos, can you relate? Is that how you feel? It's the best feeling ever. Like, I'll catch a glance of myself in the mirror, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> it's so new, you know? Another thing that we did do, which I've been wanting to do, and I don't know how I'm gonna show you guys. How am I gonna show you guys? focus I don't know I'm gonna probably have to put another clip in I don't know how to like maybe this way I can show you but we added ghosts name right here so it says ghost to me little kitty who passed away you guys can kind of see this way I know it's hard to see but we basically added her name and this um, paw print if you didn't watch my last video is her actual ink print paw print that um they took at the vet when she passed away so just really near and dear to my heart and i don't want to cry just thinking about her i love her so much now i always have her with me i'm so excited i am obsessed with this i can't wait to like bring it all together pricing wise i know some of you are gonna ask so obviously this is all on an individual basis like everybody's tattoo each artist like everything is so different so for me Michaela ended up charging 400 for this session I did book her out for the full day so um and I did tip her you guys tip your tattoo artists like if nobody has told you FYI like that's the etiquette um I always tip her about like at least a hundred dollars so I just you got to take care of the people that take care of you you know this stuff is on you forever this is really intense serious art so take care of take care of the people you care about okay money talks honey money talks let me grab my aftercare products really quick we'll talk about that and then i think that's basically everything aftercare um michaela recommends that you wash with a foam antibacterial soap this is dial antibacterial foam soap it's unscented fragrance free you want to make sure you stay away from that because that can kind of you know impact the healing process foam because it's just gentler and it doesn't pull at the skin this is called hustle butter um, luxury tattoo care deluxe before during after so basically you can get this um oh my god it smells really good it has like i think mangoes in it yeah this product contains mangoes um you can see what it looks like it's basically like a it literally it's like a butter consistency and it kind of melts as you put it on and I put it on the wrong fingers you guys so I'll just kind of show you I could probably put some more on right now because I've been on zoom calls and in front of these lights so um it just goes on really nice this is so nourishing and I've used this for all my tattoos and honestly guys if you look at the difference like this has been healed for gosh a while now and it doesn't look that different from this one so that just shows you how it helps to take care of that the of the tattoo Ugh, words but obviously i don't know why i'm like making this fist obviously um how your artist does the work is gonna influence how it holds up and you know wears throughout time as well but anyway that being said those are my aftercare things i'll link those products below for you guys if you're interested you can get this on amazon or ulta 
Um, either way, Amazon, I think, taxes a little more for it, but you know, whatever. Oh yeah, something else I forgot to mention is when it comes to working out, really avoid working out like the actual muscle because you're gonna irritate the tattoo, the healing process, probably for the first like two to three days, at least that's what Michaela has found. Um, the other thing is like sweating is probably not super great. So I did work out, I didn't work out um, yesterday, but today I did work out, got a light workout in and you know, everything seemed okay. But of course shower right away, wash it, rehydrate, all that good stuff. So let me know what you guys think about my tattoo. I'm so excited to be working on completing my sleeve. So much fun. And of course I'm gonna be filming all my future tattoo appointments. I set up two appointments for myself um, already. So, cause she had a cancellation and then she's already booking out to like December. So crazy. Um, so I took her cancellation in June and then December too. So we're gonna wait four weeks and then get back after this a little bit. Let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions about tattooing or my sleeve or my artist. Of course, I will link Michaela's information down below. And she's currently working out of My Little Needle in Plymouth, Michigan. So if that's something that interests you, you're in the area and you'd wanna try her or another artist, um, they have some pretty amazing, talented people working there. So yes, it's just always such a treat to see her. And I'm so glad I got this done. Honestly, tattoos are like a form of self-care for me at this point. Give this video a thumbs up. It really fucking helps me out. And also, please subscribe to my channel. We are growing. We are growing. We are growing on YouTube. You want to be a part of this community. I know you do. So you've already watched all my other videos. You might as well subscribe. <laughs> and if you are subscribed, honestly, thank you for hanging out with me here on YouTube. It means a lot to me. It makes my heart happy. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!